Mr. Foodtastic has for us. Bill. I tell you, life is short, so eat more biscuits. That's the gospel according to the Bishop of Biscuits, Mr. Foodtastic, Chef Jay Jackson, who's made all these biscuits and is blessing all of the world with his biscuit tasticness. What is it about a biscuit that just really brings you home, takes you back? When you say the word biscuit, a smile goes on the face. It does. You can't say it without a smile. You can't. You can't say it without a smile. It's the pillowiness. <laughs> it's the softness. It's the cloudy texture. I feel like this is what they would serve in heaven, like every day. Uh, <laughs> I think you're right. <laughs> oh I, I th and I, I hope to know one day. One day, hopefully. Cross yeah, your it, it, whoever gets all, there first, we get there. <laughs> then we'll, we'll send the other one a little message. Absolutely. How'd you get into the biscuit business? The biscuit business, I was in a competition, really short story. I was in a competition, um, and one of the sandwiches I made was a biscuit sandwich with mac and cheese, fried chicken. Um, Inside the biscuit? It was called. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> it was a delicious uh, biscuit sandwich that I told thousands and thousands of them, fell in love with biscuits, and I've been making biscuits ever since. It, it just doesn't stop. Yeah. It, it just yeah. takes you to it's, a place in your heart that nothing else can do that. It just makes me happy. So it I makes keep, me happy. I keep making them. Yeah. As the holidays yeah. should, yeah. and they will if we take a little bit of your advice for how to shop for people who love food, and yeah. that's everybody in New Orleans 100%. for the holidays. What you got here? I, I think I saw some gingerbread men so or a lot people. Of stuff. Or There's a lot of stuff. And the number one thing I tell people, your number one hack for giving gifts for foodies or anybody is to think. It's a very simple thing. That's right? simple, but sometimes <laughs> difficult. <laughs> it is difficult. We have either time or money, right? One of those resources we have available to us. And if you don't have all the funds, put a little thought into the gift idea that you want to give. So I've kind of broken it into three quick sections. Uh, one is like, uh, very convenient or tools that will help you in the kitchen even more. Typical bread box, but you would never think of a bread box that has a cutting board with it, right? Very well, fun, could it also be a biscuit gift. box? It could be a biscuit <laughs> box. You could house all your biscuits in there. I didn't even think to put those in May there. I? Exactly. I don't know that that will fit, but well, I was <laughs> trying to think. Top. Yeah, they can absolutely <laughs> go on top. <laughs> Storage containers. Uh, I live in New York, so those are super convenient. You may live in New York, but your heart's in New Orleans, baby. Always, Especially always. with these biscuits. All right, oh, yeah. so this is the icing. The icing on the cake is what? This is an eggnog drizzy. Drizzy. LBJ and Amy, to fasten your seat belts for this. Eggnog you won't be the same after this. <laughs> All right. Uh, this yeah. is an egg nog oh, drizzy. Oh, yeah. Drizzy. Look at that. Yeah. Drizzy. That now good. that. Yeah. That's beyond biscuits. Yeah, just Ooh. go ahead and bring them, bring them in. Bill bring those. Bill, I'll take the collard green point. university shirt and I one of those egg nog biscuits. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh, they so they are Thank just you, Bill. Biscuits. Thank so you. Biscuits. That's a standing ovation biscuit. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Thank you.